Hello family, welcome back to the channel. If you're new, my name is Anthony. Uh, I know I've been missing for a while, but I'm here today to share with you a Dollar Tree haul. Um, my Dollar Tree did go up to the Dollar Twenty Five price, uh, like the beginning of January. So uh, a lot of people were hauling, and theirs was already switched over before the New Year, but ours was in January. So I'm here with a. Dollar Tree haul finally. Um, I did post a couple videos on my other channel. It's where I'd share my paper crafting and then um, junk journal supplies that I pick up at Dollar Tree and Goodwill, pretty much anywhere. But I share that over there. Sometimes some of my Dollar Tree items will be in both videos if I think that you would like to see it on this channel uh, anything new as far as in the crafting section uh, I'll try to remember to sometimes put it in these or you can hop over there and check out those videos as well that channel is Zant's Sweet Inspiration and I'll have it linked in the description box as well so let's jump into it we'll start off with the food uh, as I normally do so um, I found these General Mills Czech Cereal. These are the apple cinnamon flavored. I did grab three boxes of these because one thing about my family, they love cereal and they love the apple cinnamon flavor. So um, I did pick up three of these. These are 12 ounce boxes. Um, the expiration date is soon. It's April 28th, so the end of April uh, of this year. But these boxes aren't that big and I think we'll go through them pretty quick. So I got three of those. And then they have these family size boxes of the rice aroni beef flavor. They are 13.6 ounces. So I did pick up two of these. Um, what's the best buy date on these? Uh, best buy date for these is July of this year. So just make sure you check the dates if you don't think you'll be able to get to them. You know, you don't want to pick up too many. So, But that, that was a good deal for the family size. I did pick up a bag of these croutons. These are new fills. I don't think I've had this brand before, but they're seasoned croutons. The packaging sold me. They look really good. Um, let's see. I'm looking for a date. Well, I don't see a date on here. It probably is, but I don't see it. And this is a five ounce bag. So for a dollar twenty-five, that's that's okay. That's a good deal. Then I found some fiber one bars. These are the chewy oats and chocolate. So you get nine grams of fiber per bar. Only four grams of fat per bar. And best buy date on these is April 2022. So still a couple months. Okay, I grabbed two, no, three packages of the ultra thin pizza crust. You get two in a package. These are the um, home style. Home Style Baking Golden Home Bakery Products since 1937. These are definitely a repurchase. I buy these all the time for my girls to make little pizzas. But we're having barbecue chicken pizza 
on um, the menu this week so I thought I'd just do some small personal ones and the best buy date on this is August 1st um, all three of these August 1st of this year so I've got three of those and then I found some potato sticks oh I'm sorry I keep bumping you now they had um, other flavors of these these are by Better Made Special. So I got the Sweet Barbecue. They also had a Cheddar. They had the Original. And they also had a Hot. So they were spicy. And the Best Buy date on here is July of 2022. The next are these wafer rolls. These are the similar to the ones that are in the in the cans. Only thing these are smaller and they have sections in, in the container. So um, I picked up the chocolate cream filled ones. It's a 5.29 ounce. And these are best by February of 2023. So got the chocolate. Now I have tried the hazelnut one since hazelnut is one of my favorite. So my son and I ate a box of these already. Um, but I picked up the chocolate ones for us to try. And this one is good until uh, February of 2023. Actually, both of them. They're in there. The Best Buy date is February 21st, which is today, which is my hubby's birthday. So I got those two. Then I picked up two boxes of these. Now I did open it and try it. They looked at like they were more higher end, more than a dollar twenty-five. So I grabbed two of them. You get three packages like that in there. They're called Choco Shocks. So I did Google these and a box just like this with the three packages. It came up at $8 and some change. So I was right when I, I felt they were more than the $1.25 and I, I did notice they were not Dollar Tree brand. Now these have a Best Buy date of November of this year. But they are good, and of course the reason why I grabbed them is that hazelnut filling. Well, it's a flavored filling, and it's a chocolate-covered wafer bar. So, um, they remind me of the, what are they called? Bueno. I don't know, something like, I don't know if it's the same company as the Kinder Eggs are made by or what, but... They're good, so I grabbed those. I think that's the last of the food items. Next, I picked up a couple cards. One, actually, this is a birthday card for my hubby. These are two for $1.25. And then I picked up a St. Patty's Day card for a friend. It's my hus husband's birthday today, so I did grab a few things for the occasion. I have to pick up his cake today, so I did grab two of the um, candles, the number candles, and please forgive me again. Oh, I, I said that on the last video. My hubby is sleeping. Got off late last night, so he is snoring, if you hear that in the background. Hopefully, I'm talking over him, but he's pretty loud. Um, so, yeah, anyway, I got the 43, the 4, and the 3. He is 43 today. So, yeah, it comes in two pieces because you get the little uh, happy birthday little uh, sign there. 
I did pick up some red streamers because I was not sure if I had any on hand. I do have streamers here, but I wasn't sure. And I just thought since I still have Valentine's uh, decoration up and his birthday is in this month that I would just decorate with some um, red streamers and incorporate some balloons and stuff. So uh, there is 150 feet of flame resistant crepe paper streamers here. And then I grabbed a bag of the balloons. Depending on the balloons that you pick up, the number Oh, I don't know if it cut off on me, but depending on the um, number of, I mean, depending on the type of balloon, the number is different. Like they had some birth, ha birth some balloons that said happy birthday, but there was like 15 in the bag. But anyway, I grabbed this one. There's multiple colors and a variety of colors, so I'll pick out the red and I might incorporate another color. I'm not sure yet. So that's those. And then I just got some... Happy birthday plates for like the cake, um, cake and ice cream or whatever. You get 18 party plates. And then I got the matching napkins. And there are 20 napkins in the package. So got those for him. And then I'm always picking up napkins for my crafting. So these you'll probably see in on the other channel when I share over there but I did pick up a few packages these are new ones that have come in my Dollar Tree um, this is actually in the new um, spring fling line this year so you get 18 in there love to use these for de decoupaging on things and um, this is another new one so I think they're going to have the B theme in the spring collection again um, there's 14 of these uh, it says be positive with the little B and then the last one looks like this I thought these were really pretty and you can see the label spring fling so 18 in, in those so got those I did pick up a few things out of the Easter section. I will not be going crazy in the Easter section because I have a lot of Easter items. Uh, I don't know where my little Easter bunny, my little gnome. I grabbed it the other day and I was saving it to share with you, but I don't see it right now. But anyway, I picked up one of the hand soaps. They had the bunnies and the chicks. I know I still have a couple of these from last year, so I just picked up one and I got the bunny. Um, I don't know the scent on that, so. Also, these were new this year to me, I think. I'm not sure if I've seen them last year or not. But they're the Easter eggs, you know, the plastic Easter eggs. But these are shaped like cupcakes and little pastries. Like decorate the egg shape is shaped like a um, decorated like pastries and the little cupcakes. I thought these were super cute. Um, I even thought of like you know using them on my tear tray for decor. I mean, you can't get a whole lot of these, but um, I don't know. The kids probably would like to find these as well, but there are eight in the package. So those were in the Easter display as well as this one. They look like little Legos in the pastel colors. So I grabbed a package of those. I thought those were cute. I did get one sign. Because when I saw it, it reminded me of the little gnome with the bunny ears that I picked up, the little plush. So it says welcome. And it's pretty big. 
So, got that. That's the only one I picked up. Only one I plan on picking up. Unless I see something that's just super cute and I can donate some of my older ones. So, that, that's it, I think. Oh, no, it's not. I did pick up these white chocolatey pretzel rods. You get two pretzel rods in the package. They're really pretty. They have um, green and lavender drizzle on them. But I got these um, to put up for the girls' baskets. I just, I don't know, I didn't know if they would be gone when it's time for me to pick them up because my Dollar Tree really has been scarce. It's like the, the items, I go in there and the shelves are empty pretty early. I grabbed a few bags of these. I did give some away for Valentine's Day. Um, this, they're fruities. You don't see fruities around here that often. Um, when I lived in Memphis for a short time, I was the candy lady and I... I used to sell these for um, what was it, one cent or two cents or something back then. I don't remember. It's been many years. But anyway, um, yeah, found the watermelon fruities. And these are by the Tipsy Roll Company. Um, and let's see, you get 45 pieces in the bag. So, yeah, I've got those. I did pick up these disposable icing bags. You get 12. They also sell the tips at Dollar Tree that you can stick in, in the bag because that's what you need to use these. You need a tip. But I already have tips here. So I just got these to have on hand. Um, they, they are in the party section. By voila. My Dollar Tree has gotten in a lot of new uh, items for decorating cakes and stuff like that. Okay, I did pick up one of these um, Color Forms Monopoly games. They do have several different games. Uh, they're in the section over by the Easter stuff, so like basket. So if you're going to make Easter baskets, they have all these different games and toys and, and stuff. But I grabbed this one to use the pieces in my junk journals, actually. So... Uh, but I wanted to share that here as well as on the other channel. Uh, let's see. I did pick up these two picture frames. Didn't know what I'm going to do with them. But, you know, that's my color. So I had to get them. They are trimmed in gold. And they fit a 4 by 6 picture. So I did get two of the frames. They did have these also in a gray trimmed in the gold as well that I, I saw so there might be other colors but I just remember seeing the, um, the gold okay I picked up this um, it's called thicker fuller hair I got two products one is this revitalizing shampoo that was something new. I thought I'd give it a try. I was going to look it up and I forgot, but it says Celluplex Pure Plant Extracts. Volumize, fortify, and replenish fine, thin, limp hair. It says it has a caffeine energizer. So I grabbed it. It is a 12 ounce bottle. And then I also grabbed the thickening serum it says the same things on it it's a five ounce bottle but it's the serum to help your hair get thicker I also picked up a bottle of the Spa Naturals coconut oil moisturizing body soften and restore skin I like to use oils on my skin this time of year it dries out so bad in the summer but um, yeah, I picked up a bottle of that, and it is a four-ounce bottle, and it is just a natural coconut oil. 
Um, I picked up a couple Matchbox, not Matchbox, Hot Wheels monster trucks for my grandsons. Um, I did get that one. Um, and then it's called Bone Shaker. This one's called Bone Shaker. It has a little skull up top. And then this one is called Roger Dodger. And it's blue. So I thought they would like those. I don't know if I'm saving them for their monthly box or um, Easter baskets or whatever, but I've seen those and I grabbed them from them. And the last item, y'all, is this um, uh, fragrance booster. I like to throw some of this in my washing machine. It makes the laundry smell really nice. This is the spring scent. So Dollar Tree has carried this before. So I just went ahead and grabbed it. It's a 10.5 ounce. So that is my haul, y'all. Thank you for clicking on the video. Uh, sorry I've been missing. I'm going to try to get back at it. I will do a video. I would like to do a video every week. But sometimes it's just not possible for me. But I'm going to start trying to get some more content on this channel. Like I said, go over and check out the other channel. I'm working on that one as well. Especially if you like seeing um, paper grafting and stuff like that. So uh, if you have not subscribed, I don't know what you're waiting on, go ahead and subscribe. Uh, your girl will be back with some more videos. Um, give this video a thumbs up. And until the next one, everyone, stay blessed. Bye-bye.